publishing a paper in Medical Professional Education, ML Webb on Moodle Group, number 5, track 2, to week 1. By the end of this week, fellows were able to discuss the principles and concepts of publishing in a health profession education journal. Determine the steps of the publication process in health profession education journals. Assignment 1. Considering your involvement in either routine clinical research or HPE through your FAMA graduation project, describe three differences between HPE papers and clinical research papers. Assignment 2. In light of your FAMA project, fill out the shared publishing plan form. Fellow participation. Assignment. 1. 20 out of 24 fellows responded. Assignment 2. 20 out of 24 fellows responded. Week 2. By the end of this week, fellows were able. Communicate their response to the reviewer's comment effectively. Show evidence of citation of their publication in health profession education. Assignment. 3. Given your previous experience with responding to challenging reviewers' comments in your publications, kindly share with us how you respond when you do not agree with the reviewer's opinion. Assignment. Create a professional scientific profile for yourself, including all your academic and research activities, trust interests, and share the link with us. Fellow participation. Assignment. 22 out of 24 fellows responded. Assignment. 22 out of 24 fellows responded. Lessons learned. Every member of the team is very important. Being on time and staying focused makes a significant difference and pushes towards achievement. We gained valuable experience in curriculum development, from planning and setting learning objectives to preparing content, delivering it, assessing acquired data and providing constructive feedback. The schedule must be strict yet reasonable. Publishing a paper in HPE is vital for career progression. Additional lessons. Selecting the most suitable journal or portal is crucial. Following publisher recommendations is mandatory. Responding to reviewers requires extensive research and an understanding of every step. We made a real difference by encouraging fellows to create proper profiles that increase the visibility of their scholarly activities. Skills acquired. We develop skills in critiquing others' work. We practiced giving constructive feedback to both colleagues and peers. By helping fellows create appropriate profiles, we contributed to enhancing the visibility of their scholarly activities. Thank you. We built a community of practice, and together we've grown and achieved much.